Good morning, beautiful Sagittarians. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. If you're new here, I welcome you. I know the other Saggies welcome you. Guys, I want to thank you so much again for all your likes, your comments, your subscriptions, your invaluable Sag. And I want to find out what are the general energies today for Sagittarius. Fire. Sagittarius gifts. Ooh. It's somebody initiating something. What's going on? A new world. What's going on, Sag? Knowing your value, your self-worth. Someone's about to express something, do you? Maybe the universe expressing. Oh, the universe causing uh, some type of mirroring effect. Hmm. Hmm. Mirroring fears. Hmm. It's almost as if the universe is uh, bringing you in a lot of healthy, something very healthy, a new beginning. This person is afraid. Because they know your value. They know what you're worth. The universe is expressing something. There's some type of mirroring going on. So it's almost as if you've learned to nurture yourself. Know your value. You're mirroring to this person. Divine order is here, guys. The universe and divine order. Love. Somebody's about to initiate some kind of love toward you. Express their love. They're afraid. I'm going to be real. Maybe you're afraid now to love Saj. Take it as it resonates. But someone's about to express something to you. <laughs> oh yeah, that fear is that all tied up to these attachments. See, what is this? Somebody's formed attachments. This is um, you listening to the universe. Using your intuition, yeah, there is a storm cloud of brewing. The door to romance is about to be open to you, Sag. I don't know if these are your fears. I don't know. This person is afraid. It's, they're going through a, Sag, I gotta stop it right now. Like, I have to say what's here, guys. This, um... Karmic situation. I gotta say it. It's here. This karmic has tried to keep this person all tied up with all kinds of attachments, dark attachments. Uh, they are in fear that this person is going to walk away and come toward you. And the truth of the matter is they're going through a tower. And they're using envy. They're envious of you. And... They're using every trick in the book to keep this person from walking away. Some healing. This man is still holding a heart. This is the yin to your yang. This person can't stop thinking of you. Uh, the door to personal healing and happiness <clears throat> Before I even did your read, Sag, I knew that's why I've got a throat lozenge here because I can tell you right now that this karmic does not want me telling you what's going on. They're full of envy, full of deceit. 
dark attachments, all tied up, anxiety, and fear. Because this person is thinking, how do I heal this? They hold a heart toward you, masculine or feminine. They know you're the yin to their yang. This karmic knows it, is envious of you. They're going through a tower. Even if they don't know who you are, Sag, you know intuition. They suspect that this person is holding their heart for someone else. And that someone else is you. I have to put it out there because that's what's being said. What's going on? That mirroring thing so if you're thinking of them they're thinking of you if you've healed and are in this attitude of gratitude know that they also are but they're thinking how to heal and this karmic is trying to block this connection it's very plain very simple the illusion trying to block this connection because they don't want this person being single i'm just saying yep they're trying to block this person from taking a leap of faith toward you. It's that simple. They're working on something secretly. This King of Wands. Because they're at a crossroads. They are heavily burdened where they are. They see who? They who? This is where they want to go. To the Empress, the Queen of Wands. They're keeping things on the down low. They're keeping things secret. They want to close out this cycle and they want a new beginning. They want to be happy. They want to close out this cycle. They're weighing something out about their Ten of Cups. How they can walk away. They're strategizing. How to sneak away. They're hurt and they want to heal this. They're doing a lot of thinking. They're blocked off in their emotions. And they want to come toward you. There's doing something in secret. How can they sneak away from this connection? How can they come toward you and communicate? How do they express their love? Because they're wounded, something to do with their finances. They're waiting. Oh, there's that jealousy and envy. They want to fight for this. They want to win at all costs. They're fighting for their happiness. Wheel of Fortune and New Beginning. Oh, yeah. They're missing your attention. They're hoping they're going to hear good news. They got something they want to say to you, Saj. All their attention is on you. This is the truth. They want a new beginning. Tower. That player energy has something has exploded on them and spirit is saying it's justice, but 
Give me. Something is, yeah, they're regretting being a player. Something has happened to make them very sad with this other lover. They're going through a tower because somebody was a player. Their investment, and they're thinking about their money, and they're thinking about um, being trapped financially. Uh, this baby mama energy, whatever it is. Um, they're trying everything to keep them trapped for finances. I'm just saying, but it's going to end. They've made a decision to end something. Oh, trying to keep them from making a judgment. The karmic is spying on you because they know they're going to get left out in the cold, maybe with their kids. That's They're trying to keep them bound to like... Yes, they are. Any way possible. Any attachments. Children, finances, whatever. Threatening them. Hmm. They could be drinking a lot, like excessively. Reminiscing about the past. Missing you. This karmic. Yeah, it's like. What? Getting the strength. To end something. Yes. There's that Knight of Wand energy. They're offering very little to this karmic. This is the truth. They're cold. They want to communicate <clears throat> something toward you. <clears throat> Speak a truth, but I'm going to tell you they're afraid. They're trying to be smart and wise with this karmic. It's like... They're not offering the karmic much. They want to offer very little. Because they know that this karmic is money hungry. This is the truth. They want to speak to their soulmate. Something about manipulating, non-trust in this commitment. They're afraid. They're slow to commit, but they want to commit. Uh, this is news. Fighting and arguing. Competition. About the father. And about contracts. And about going to court. This emperor. Wanting to move. The third party is trying to keep them stuck. And they're getting hostile and angry. So no matter what the karmic energy is trying to do to this person. They're bossing up. They're moving. They want... It's like they're angry that they're stuck with the third party. They want to move. They're working on something in secret. They're fighting and arguing about court or a job or a business or a contract. This karmic, they're fighting and arguing. I don't know. They want to heal things with you. They see you as the star. They're angry that they're stuck with a third party. They want to move, but it's something to do with a contract. They're fighting about a contract or a business or something to do contractually, maybe with their business. I don't know. There's some type of news that they want to share with you. It is also that they could be fighting and arguing about you, Sagittarius. I'm going to be real. It's like this person 
wants to make you an offer. They're coming in as the emperor. There's a few pages here, but It's a gift. They want to give you some type of gift. They want to initiate some kind of communication. They're, they're moving away from the third party. They're going through a tower. They're fighting and arguing. And it's about going to the courthouse. It is about... a contract a legal, some kind of legal contract. It could be a legal separation. I don't know. I don't know. They're trying to pacify the karmic, but they're doing something in secret behind the karmic's back. And the karmic is getting wise to something. They know that this person has somebody on their mind. They either know about you, Sagittarius, and are spying on you. They're jealous of you. They're envious of you. But if they don't know who you are, Sag, it's they are suspicious. Okay? They know something's up with this emperor. They know that this emperor is not thinking of them because they're being offered breadcrumbs. They're being offered very little. Their cup is empty what they're offering to this karmic. All the karmic wants is money. That's that damned uh, empty promises and empty, they're offering them empty offers. I'm just saying they don't trust this karmic. The karmic does not trust this person. They're, they got the jig up that this person could, they, they could be fighting about you, Saj. I'm pretty sure they are. Even if this karmic does not know who you are, they know that this person has somebody on their mind other than them. They're going through a tower with this other lover. They're trying to figure out a plan how they can sneak away. Look. How they can sneak away because they're heavily burdened it's like they're trying to decide something about this family situation how they can sneak away they're doing things in quiet secretly wanting to sneak away and come towards you and this karmic is trying to block them at every move yes they are there's envy Deceit, a storm, and it's about trying to keep them all tied up with dark attachments. But this karmic is in fear and I'm going through a lot of anxiety because they know that this person got somebody else on their mind. A lot of you, they know who you are. A lot of them, they don't know who you are, but they're suspicious because they're being offered very little. So if this Karmic is cluing in, well, if my person is not giving to me, who are they giving to? All right. Mm. Well, looks as if this person, there's mirroring going on. So if you're thinking of them, they're thinking of you. They want to express something to you. There is fear here of this new beginning because now they know you know your worth. Divine order has been called. The universe has called for divine order in this situation. This love connection. So with the universe involved, just know anything goes here. I'm just saying. And you know what? If uh, you're not entertaining a past person, Sag, this is someone new who wants to communicate with you and express something toward you. There is fear there. A 
I just know yin and yang, the door to personal healing and happiness is being opened towards Sagittarius. Somebody does want to heal something with you. Whether you're entertaining a past person or not, there might be a new person coming in because new love is here as well. Divine order is being called. So whatever your intentions are, Sag, if you're only looking for new, it looks like the doors are opening up for you. If you are receptive to a past person, they want to communicate and express their love toward you. Just saying, take care, Sag.